Oh damn, this is a big map too. Okay, let's uh take a look see. Let's see. Oh cool. Cool, look how much so much emblem energy too. Damn. That's that's really good for us. Okay, so we have some axes on the right. We have some spears on the left. Looks like the usual crap. Who's that in the middle? Hortensia? You can actually see her range if you look at the minimap real quick. So luckily she doesn't doesn't have crazy range. In terms of people who I'm gonna take. Uh, we can take 12 people. Damn, that's a lot. We'll take Diamant. We'll also take. Just so weak. Celine without Celica is so weak. I think we'll just take Marin. Because Marin. Marin has some good uh good um mobility. I think we're gonna do a little bit of warping once we begin the battle. Because I'm going to warp good old Divine Dragon over there. And he's going to kill everybody. I think we'll just start off engaging right away with Hortensia. Emblem. Engage. And then we'll use Astro Storm. There should be a flyer. Wow, it's really laggy. So actually, I leveled up Elfire a lot. And it still doesn't kill this guy, which is pretty pathetic. Damn, I did, this map looks good, by the way. I Look at the backdrop. Looks so nice. <laughs> This will hurt. Okay. You put up a good fight. Too bad we too bad we picked up the damage there, but what you gonna do? Damn, it looks so good. Like if we look at Looks amazing. You can even can you see the leaves? Look, you can even see the leaves. Hell yeah. Okay. I kind of I, I don't think I'm actually gonna warp on myself. Cause I don't know. It just feels I guess it's not cheating. Right, it's not technically cheating. I just think it's gonna be a really tough situation for this guy, for the Divine Dragon, myself. I'm listening. Like, I I guess we could it's I mean like we could tale. do this. We could divine blessing him. See how this goes, I suppose. Cause then we warp him over here. And he can probably I mean, I can probably take out quite Here a few. Goes. You know, I could probably... Lend me your strength. I could probably take out quite a few of these guys. I take zero damage from this dude? How's that even possible? Unforgivable. Bond XP between Ivy and Linz at max. Cool. That's good for us. Yeah, these pussies are not gonna even attempt to uh, get into melee range. That is definitely- this guy's in melee range? Dude, what a psychopath. Okay, I mean, if he, if he wants to do that, he can do it. I think it's a horrible idea, but... Reinforcements already? Cool. I picked up, um... Yeah, I picked up a new, a new skill, or a new weapon. Because my bond with Lucina got to level 10. So I picked up Parthia, which is pretty broken. Doubles users, it's kind of like... Uh, what was it called? It's kind of like Marth's sword, but for Lucina. I had to stop you. Steel blade obtained. Um, I think we give that to what's her face. I think we give that to. I can't remember. Oh, this is a lot of damage. Oh shit. Oh, shit. Okay, we survived. <laughs> you know, stays engaged one additional turn. Dude, Lucina is... First of all, Lucina's a level... Um, what should I say? Lucina is a level 20 bond, so y you can really get a lot out of her. It's nice. It's nice. Are you 
You put up a good fight. Damn, Diamant. Damn, son. Dude, don't give a fuck. Oh, thank God. That guy's retreating. <laughs> I can't believe... I'm like, I'm shocked this guy retreated. I don't think I've ever seen the enemy do that once. Um, these guys are a bit of a problem, because they're very tanky. So... Yeah, we can't even kill with you. Actually, we could kill you. Yeah, we could kill these armored guys, but it leaves us very exposed, which is the problem. We need to level up Chloe, by the way, because uh, she's actually max level. So this is a waste of XP. Do I have any Master Seals? I'll check after this fight. I'm ready. Oh, there's a bunch of enemies up here still. Okay. Well, we're definitely going to go for the chest, because the chest... Lots of goodies in the chest. Might even... Hopefully a dagger, because I'm still using... I mean, it's not so bad, because I have a silver dagger now, but... Eh, could be better. I was kind of thinking about what my favorite region is in the game. Because I'm a weirdo like that. I don't know, I'm just weird. And, um... I don't know. I don't know. I actually, I really like Soam. Soam, I think Soam is just really... All the... My my favorite ballerinas have been in Soam. And I think... I think, yeah, I mean... Probably Filene is the worst. It's just... It's kind of generic. And kind of, eh, kind of boring. I'll do as you command. Damn. This is what I trained Alfred for. is like... Alfred's like a cavalry killer. That's like... That's kind of his like main go-to thing. Which which I'm fine with. Because it's really broken. I'll apologize later. If you're wondering why Alchris did more damage that turn, it's actually because he has something called Luna. And it pretty much goes through enemies' resistance. It's really nice. It's a nice skill. This will hurt. You put up a good fight. I was kind of talking to some of my friends who play this game, and um, I think the Wo Dao, even though it gives you less, it does give you less damage, but it gives you such a high crit chance. And if you can get a double attack in, I think it's worth it. Just to use the bow down instead. Okay, first chest. Silver Spirit Art. That sounds pretty cool. I haven't used the monk thing that much in this game. I don't really care either. It's just, um, I don't know. Maybe I'll use it when I play Maddening. Worm Slayer. That sounds fucking awesome. Boots? Boots? Huh? Oh, I bet you that gives you more movement. Radiant Bow? Oh my god. Also, I've kind of been cheaping out on using Physic lately. Because if you want to buy a Physic, it's 3,000 gold. Which I think is... I think that's a little bit much if you ask me, but... Okay, so I've been fucking around, and looks like reinforcements came. Which doesn't really surprise me, because I definitely have been kind of... Farting. Not really doing anything. Wait. Zephy? Oh, they're all in here? Oh. Alright. Makes my life a little bit more difficult. I won't falter. I had to stop you. We haven't caught their attention yet somehow, which is surprising. Okay, I'm just gonna aggro these guys. Bring them into the corner. Two... Oh, she has two stones. Damn. Two stones kinda sucks. Stone Palace is so pretty! <laughs> it's a nicer tomb than you deserve. I think that I... Uh, that's at least... Oh shit. Hurricane Axe? That sounds amazing. 
Yeah, I think that I think that is Jinx. It's not Arcane Jinx. It's definitely Jinx. This would actually kill this guy. Flame Lance? Dude, these guys are they have all the good shit, these little bastards. Your army is not to be trifled with. Because I respect you, I will hold nothing back. Alas. Wait, the flame lance? You can use the flame lance as a ranged attack? My orders do not involve dying. I take my leave. So Zephia has um, a thingy. She has a revival stone. Of course she does. The stolen rings. You'll return them, won't you? Here we go. I'm sorry. That was a pretty cool looking attack she had. Can't wait to use it myself. Time to finish the job. Quite strong. That would have been too easy, I suppose. We'll meet again soon enough. I challenge my fate. This is it. I will help. Perfect. Perfect chain attack. Perfect. The floor's slippery. That's the only reason I lost. I'm going home. She even has bows on her shield. That's fucking. That's cute. Hurricane axe. Magical axe that smashes foes. Damn, that's so good. It's actually so amazing. 43 damage? She's using a... She has a, a lance of her own, too. I must get the rings. I must save father. <laughs> Dream well. Defeat you. It's the only way to. The emblem is surging with fell dragon energy. Be on your guard. The fuck does that mean? Bow sync with dark emblems may enter a rampage state when they use revival stones. Their additional strength. What? Where do these guys come from? I didn't even see these stairs in here. Oh. My god. Can't get a break. Can't get a fucking break. I'll go first. <laughs> Was that too much? Damn it, I have the bow equipped. And damn it. That's the only- I think there's actually a ring you can get that switches your weapon automatically. Which sounds absolutely overpowered as hell. <laughs> that sounds... is that? That looks overpowered. And spooky. How many of these guys are there here? They just keep spawning? Dude, what? It's gonna keep spawning forever? Some broken ass shit? I, I want to get greedy and go for these kills, but I think she's gonna unleash some really crazy shit any second now, so I think we'll just take the kill.
18 turns. Okay, to be fair, probably six, probably five or six of those were me waiting. That was still a long battle, though. Ivy, what happened? Oh, you've come back to me. Thank goodness. Where'd all the Illusion soldiers go? They retreated. I should go with them. No, it's not safe. Zephia could take control over you again. But... I was the last person left at Elusia Castle. Without me, there'll be no one to lead. No one to take care of the country Father left behind. That is true. But it's out of our hands. How can you say that? Don't you care about Elusia at all? Of course I do. I would have given my life to protect our kingdom. But it is not our kingdom anymore. It's the Fell Dragons. Surely you see that. <sighs> Princess Ivy. I didn't want to admit it, but father stopped being king as soon as the fell dragon awoke. Since then, true power has rested with Sombron, his daughter, and the four hounds. If you went back now, you would become an instrument of their designs, just as father was. I... I want to go home too. You have no idea how badly, but there's no home to go back to until we defeat the fell dragon. After allowing Father to relinquish his power to Sombron, we owe our people no less. <sighs> the castle. My only home since I was little. We really can't go back now, can we? No. We can't. That little nook where I had tea with my friends. The garden where you and I read together. Even Rosado and Goldmary. I've left everything and everyone behind. All right, Ivy. I'll join this fight. So that someday, things can be like they were again. Thank you, Hortensia. I'm really sorry for... for what I did. Divine One, you should have this. The Ring of the Instructor. One of the rings stolen from Lethos. Thank you for returning it. Don't give me too much credit. I wasn't exactly planning to hand it over. Even so, you have my thanks. Teach us! Emblem of the Academy! What? That's who this is? What? I am Emblem Byleth. It feels as though I've just awoken from a very long dream. I'm glad to be where I belong. At your side. Use my power to guide everyone. I will. Thank you, Emblem Byleth. Uh huh? Dude. What? Did not see that coming. I mean, I guess it makes sense. So, how is everyone? Queen Sephoria, you're all right. That I am. Some Illusion soldiers tried to seize me, but I was saved at just the right moment. We took them down. Alfred and I intended to help. But by the time we'd drawn our weapons, the fight was already over. <sighs> <laughs> That's the Solemn Royal Guard for you. Pretty good, right? I'm just glad the Queen is safe. Well done, everyone. Well done yourself. No more trespassers. My palace is rid of them. Divine One, thank you for protecting the rings and my family with such courage. The way you spoke, the look in your eyes. You were the spitting image of Queen Lumera. <laughs> your words mean so much. Thank you. Um, excuse me, Queen Sephoria? You! I assumed you had gone back to Illusia. Look, I'm really sorry about what I did. I'll accept whatever punishment you give me. I owe you an apology as well. <sighs> Queen Sephoria, please. Zephia was using some sort of magic to control Princess Hortensia. As soon as it wore off, she stopped fighting. 
even gave me her emblem ring. I don't recall Zephyr being there when the young princess held me hostage. Look me in the eyes, you two. Uh, okay. Threatening a queen's life is a grave crime. You deserve a room in the dungeons. <sighs> but I won't send you there. You won't? It was the Fell Dragon's minions who broke in and started the conflict, right? Your only crimes were slipping in uninvited and threatening to kill me. If you want to make amends, defeat the Fell Dragon, rebuild your kingdom. When cooler heads return to Illusia, Solm can only benefit. Let's move on now, shall we? Thank you, Queen Sephoria. Your show of compassion will not be forgotten. We will restore Illusia. I swear it. For my part, I think I'd better look into shoring up the palace's defenses. You're right. The Fell Dragon's forces might come back for you. I can leave some soldiers here to help keep you safe. Oh, no need, no need. I have lots of family members who can handle things here. If the situation really boils over, I can always leave a double here and wander the land. So don't worry about me. You just focus on taking out the Fell Dragon. We will. Thank you. Tamara, it's time you show the Divine Dragon where to find Soam's other ring. A sure thing, Mom. One ring of the crux of fate coming right up. Where is it? The Northern Fortress. Oh. You don't scare easily, do you? Ooh, spooky. Oh, shit. Nice. 40,000. God damn. God damn. It's going right into Master Seals. Actually, Master Seals or Investments? Either way. Dude. Yes. Byleth. Uh, instruction boost ally stats. Sometimes turn missed attacks into hits. Emblem Byleth is the first first engaged weapon is a hero's relic. Oh, that ah, makes sense. Oh, I see aimer, and I see fail not. The engage skill instruct grants a stat bonus to surrounding allies. Do so you want to put this on somebody who's in the thick of it? Engage attack goddess dance grants a stat boost. Wait, what? Grants a stat boost and empowers those? You can act twice? That is ridiculously broken. Nice. Okay, emblem ring. Who are we gonna put this on? We need to put this on somebody who's in the thick of it. So... Hortensia? Kind of thinking that, right? Somebody... Somebody mobile, but also kind of tanky. Like a... Like a flying unit of some type. I guess we could do Hortensia then. Let's go. Byleth. All right, cool, cool. I was kind of thinking of making Hortensia a different class, but we only have one flying unit, so yeah, it's probably it's probably good to have two of them. Actually, three. We have three. Oh, that reminds me. I should have. How many master seals do I have? Uh, none. Okay, fine. We have this Radiant Bow, by the way. Um, doesn't look as good as I thought it was. I mean, it's still obviously amazing, but... Yeah, I thought this would have been better. So I guess we can give it to Alchrist. Sure. Take it, Alchrist. Let's give Diamant the Worm Slayer. You know, actually, Byleth may be good on Diamant. I was kind of thinking of that. I know Diamant has a uh, leaf, but he's kind of... Always in the front lines doing stuff, you know? So, could be a could be a good combo. Oh, we have a Master Seal. We can make um, Hortensia into a Sleep Sleepner Rider. Whatever the fuck that is. The Knight Who Rides the Charming Pegasus, Pegasus Sleepner. So this would let her... Okay, so it's another Mage. I'm fine with this. I think Mages are just broken in this game. Because they heal, they do... Tons of damage to knights. So yeah. <laughs> she kind of looks like a clown. <laughs> she does. She, she does kind of look like a clown. It's funny. Forgive me. 
Thank you, Divine One. Starting now, I'll be on the right side for you and for Ivy. That's good. That's good. Thank you. I'm glad to hear it, Hortensia. Divine One, my sincere thanks for welcoming me with my sister. No problemo. This place looks nice, by the way. Pretty cool palace. Thanks. We won because you insisted on protecting the rings and our queen. You got it. Sorry I took your ring, and probably it'll never use you. I'm, I'm gonna use your brother. <laughs> Things were touch and go for a bit, but you and Tamara played it cool. Played it cool. Zappy. Yeah, this is probably the nicest area, if you even want to call it that, that we've experienced so far. Very pretty. Oh, little alcove there. Just, it feels like, oh man. So beautiful. Okay, that's enough of this. Back to the Somnial. Gotta spend some of this money I got. Hmm. Another ring in the Divine Dragon's hands. Still, not enough to turn the tide. <sighs> I must sleep. Curse this feeble form of mine for plunging me into darkness. I pray that next time my waking hours will not end so soon. I have a feeling she's being possessed by the dragon thing. Now then. Princesses Ivy and Hortensia reunited at last. Princess Ivy must be quite relieved. You're a good looking guy. Too bad you kinda suck. He doesn't suck, I just I just don't want to use him. Got some master seals for I sale. Let's go, boy. Okay, so let's let's uh choose some stuff we want to use for Hortensia. I'm thinking. Wow, this stuff's expensive. This stuff is expensive. I think we should have another healer. I thank you. And then we can give her. Um, I like fracture. I do like fracture because it stops enemies. It stops bullshit attacks from happening. I think I'm gonna use freeze. I thank you. Because freeze can be freeze can be pretty clutch, especially when you have some do dumbass running at you. All right, so let's go to Chloe. Change class into a Griffin Knight. Uh, yep, this is the one. Nice. You know, it's strange, we still haven't found a new fishing rod. And I don't know when I'm going to find one, because there's pretty much three fishing rods in the game. So I imagine it'll come later on. What's this? Little hut thing? Huh, okay. She only ever sells gifts here, huh? Except for steel ingots. Yeah. I mean, this is good, I guess, if you're trying to level up people really quick. But... To come again. Actually, how cheap was that? Well, hello. That seemed really cheap. 20 gold? And you can buy infinite? Favored by Solmic fans of flowers. Wow, some of this stuff is so expensive, Feel and some of it is again. so dirt cheap. Why is Tiki alone? Is this supposed to... I thought emblems... Huh? Eh? Thanks. I'm so happy I get to be here with my sister. I just hope Rosado and Goldmary are doing okay. They're gonna be corrupted. I can already smell it. Because she was like... Oh, you'll deal with them soon enough, ha ha ha, in that laugh, and so, that pretty much tells you they are, they're not doing too well, nope. I'll be your opponent. I am Lucina. Let's see what you can do. Oh my god, Lucina is Rize. This is nothing. It is, isn't it? I, I am the divine dragon. I finally discovered it. I lost? Somehow I won. Dude, Lucina is Laura Bailey. That's why it sounds so familiar. Nice. I still find it odd to fight alongside a family heirloom. But I'm glad you're here, Lynn. Elugia's royal family has a special place in my heart. I'm happy to lend you my strength. You know what I realized as I'm playing more of this game? And kind of like, oh, Mani Kati, Divine Sword Welded by Emblem Lynn? God damn, what? 
That's actually so good. Anyway. You know what I'm kind of realizing? Let's take a look at the emblem rings. Let's look at Byleth. Okay, so, no. This game, no. That's not what he looks like. He does not look like this in Three Houses. He has, like, he has those really strange bug eyes. And that, I know that's, like, the running joke and everything, but... Like... Look, look... It, this is not representative. This is not what he looks like. Alright. We also need to give the Hurricane Axe to Diamant. Diamant's gonna be... This is, this is a powerful fucker. This guy is... This guy is powerful. He has anti-dragon, anti-armor, anti-wind, or anti-flyer. Dude, is no joke. Okay, we can actually refine the Hurricane Axe. Um, 24 damage. It's really expensive. Really expensive, but I think I think it's worth it. Maybe this one's not worth it, because you only get one extra might, but I, I think this one, Hurricane Axe level 3, hmm. seems like a good in-between. I mean, we might as well might as well upgrade the Radiant Bow, I guess. Yeah, it's only another 3,000. Because, like, you're paying two... You have so you have to use so much more materials, only for plus two, and it's like doesn't seem I don't know doesn't seem worth it. Welcome. Okay, Anna, let's make let's see. Let's do Ivy and From. Perfect. Look at this. Um, actually, never mind. Let's do Ivy and nope. Ivy and Lapis. Nice. This can be damn. This can be a good meal. Candied fruits. Sounds. This merchant is also a great chef. I don't like knives much, but I'll do my best. I'd put this up against any cook's best. Lovely aroma. Mm, I love this flavor. Probably an A. B? Take this meal. Oh, on the house. Only a B? I thought it was going to be better than a B. Looked pretty good to me. Oh, well. Alright, so we have about 2,000 supports to do. Because, um, I don't know, they, they just stack up randomly. So, Fram at level A, nice. Ivy, Etier, Tamara. Okay, let's start. Fram, I'm sorry for what I said. I didn't mean to upset you. Nah, it's okay. I'm sorry for bursting into tears like that. I've just felt really attached to you since you woke up no scratch that since before you woke up i used to sit and chat with you about my life really yeah if something exciting happened i'd tell you the good news with a big smile on my face or if something was making me sad i'd sit next to you and have a good cry about it you were always so easy to talk to every single day i sat there and waited for you to wake up i I didn't realize that. I knew you couldn't actually hear me. I was just living out my own little fantasy. But then you woke up. I was so excited to talk to you for real, I... I got kind of carried away. Fram, I have a request. Please go back to cheering for me like you did before. What? But you said... I did. But that was before I knew you kept me company for so long. As far as I'm concerned... You can be as loud and distracting as your heart desires. Oh, Divine One! You're every bit as amazing as I always imagined! Okay. I, Fram, a president of the DDFC, swear to continue my wholehearted support. As your number one fan, I'll keep cheering for you with all my heart and soul. Perfect. I wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs> mistake. And that's a mistake. You're gonna regret that. Okay. New page on Fram the Ally Notebook. Actually, what happens when you get- that's our first level A. What happens when you get something to level A? Fram? Oh! Wait, height? Wait, that's what you learn? Height? Attentive steward, but absent-minded. Best... 5-3? Ring size 4? I don't think those are the sizes people want to know. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm fucking kidding. Am I though? Hmm. Ivy, 
Do you think maybe it's time we talked? Whatever you're feeling toward me, I'm prepared to listen. As allies, I'd like there not to be walls between us. Very well. I am rather more comfortable around you now, so... I suppose it's time. I'm glad to hear that. Can we start with why you seem to have such anger toward me? I love you. Huh? I love you, Divine One. My feelings began long before I met you. Understand, I do not mean romantically. I adore you as a worshipper adores a deity. But you looked so upset when you were staring at me before. My deity was standing before me in the flesh. I was nervous. Oh. Do you understand now? Yes, um, thank you for sharing that. I, um, like you as well, Ivy. Yes, may I be excused? Oh, yes, yes, of course. And, and, I'm sorry. We'll speak again later, Divine One. How much more canon could it be? How much more canon could it be? This shit is so canon. Again, see? I, I'm just, a, I'm just the, the canon master, okay? I can detect it like that, all right? Okay, uh, Etia. I see you're staring at me again, Divine One. I was, again. <laughs> Sorry, I just can't help it. You know I don't mind. It's pretty neat, in fact. That said, I can think of better ways for you to feel good than just admiring my confidence. Such as? A hundred laps around the Somniel. Like, running? Even I get stressed sometimes. And when I do, I always go for a run. As long as I'm running, my mind is empty. It's like I'm sweating out all my troubles. Huh. Still, are a hundred laps really necessary? In my experience, yes. Anything less runs the risk of a few stray lingering doubts. So, how about it? You interested? Yes, I think. Great, let's get started. You mean now? No time like the present. Do you want to get confident or not? I hadn't planned on running a hundred laps today, but I guess it's worth a try. You're on, Etier. Let's go for a run. Now you're talking. Nope. Nope, I hate cardio. Like every other normal person, I absolutely hate long-distance cardio. Alright, Tamara. Grilled and ready to go! This meat is so yummy, it's gonna make your taste buds dance. Wow, that seems like a lot of meat for the two of us. Oh no, this one's for me. I was going to do yours next. What? How do you eat that much? Oh, you know, open my mouth, bite, chew. I won't bore you with all the details. Wow. <laughs> You're really something, Tamara. <gasps> That's true! I'm really something! I'm the Crown Princess of Solm! And I'm wearing lots of priceless jewels! Shh, please keep your voice down. I've heard that this area isn't very safe. You can say that again. It's absolutely crawling with bandits. That's why I'm out here like a nice, tempting hunk of lamb on a spit. Wait a minute. That was your plan? To use yourself as bait? It worked, didn't it? Look, those bruisers have had their eye on us since we got here. It looks like... It looks like they're getting ready for an ambush. Not if we pounce on them first. Come on, this ought to be a piece of cake for you and me. Uh, all right. But, you know, a little heads up would have been nice. <laughs> yeah, great. <laughs> okay, that's it with those. Fram and Diamonts. What? Alfred got Yunaka to A before I did? How's that even possible? I've given her like 50 gifts. What the fuck? Dude. It's not the cucking I'm talking about. Now let's do Fram and Diamant. Hello, Fram. Did you forget the history book today? 
Or did you already finish it? I... quit studying history. You quit? What happened? I thought you were finally having fun with it. Prince Diamant, you said you wanted to bring peace to the world, but is that really true? Of course it is. I would never lie about that. Then why does Brodia keep attacking Illusia? Well... I read the histories of both kingdoms. There are helpless citizens in Illusia that fear Brodia. When you talk about ending war, do you really mean conquering Illusia? Is that peace? <sighs> the more I read in that history book, the less I understood the world. It was scary. That's why I put it down. I'm done. I quit. Brodia is a kingdom of warriors. It does have a regrettable history of seizing territory by force. And it is true that some people in Illusia have been hurt by and have grown to hate Brodia. That's an undeniable part of my kingdom's past. But I won't let it be part of our future. It may not be easy, but I mean what I say. There will be change. In your own kingdom, you mean? Yes. Please, believe me. I don't know. You skipped right over the bad parts of Brodia's history last time. I didn't mean to hide any of that from you. But I suppose I have a guilty conscience about these things. I understand why you'd be upset with me. No, no. I'm not upset. I just... Uh, I don't know. I'm really letting this get to me, huh? History is so heavy. Kind of a depressing, uh, kind of a depressing SL. No, yeah. hmm. Not really a huge fan of that one. I can't get over this. You knock an ivy thing, damn it. Golly, that's weird to think about. What is? Where I'd be if I hadn't heard Micaiah's voice in that ring. I wouldn't be here at all, would I? It's kind of unnerving to think this great change in my life hinged completely on a coincidence. Nah. It's no coincidence that you're one of us now. It's just you being you. What do you mean? You're here because you wanted Micaiah's wish to come true. Thanks to your big heart, we're allies now. I'm glad to have you on the team. Aww, shuckers, Alfred. You're the one with the big heart, though. Honestly, compared to you, I'm a coward. I've hidden who I really am, all the things I've done, just for the chance to belong here. If you knew the whole truth about me, I'd have so much more to worry about. I think you'd do more than merely despise me. I think you'd actually come after me. Hmm. No. No, I wouldn't. What do you mean you wouldn't? You can't just say you wouldn't. I've been filling your head with weapon facts. You barely know a thing about me. You can't accept me for who I am without even knowing who that is. It's not right. It's unfair. Let it be unfair, then. I'm fine with that. I'm fine not knowing her past, too. I trust you, Yunaka. I always will. Come on, Alfred. I don't have to explain why I trust you. Just like you don't have to prove that I should trust you. You are... so... weird. I mean, I know I'm bizarre, but you're a whole new breed of bird. <laughs> uh, you got me there. From one weird bird to another, I hope we stay friends for a long time. Me too. Friends. Friends, right? Friends? Emphasis on friends? Alfred? A little... Little... Stupid Alfred. That stupid outfit. <sighs> what you doing up so late, Princess Ivy? Prince Alfred. I suppose it must seem rather suspicious for an illusion to be roaming alone after dark. I assure you, I have no plans to murder anyone or to set anything on fire. Of course, such assurances must mean little coming from me. Aw, oh, you don't seem so bad. I'm leaning toward trusting you by now. Oh? I am surprised to learn that the Crown Prince of Firene is so naive. If that's what I get for trusting people, then naive is my middle name. Hmm. So did you need something from me? If you were not here to doubt my motives, I would expect you to have left by now. Nah, I wouldn't leave you alone. 
And why is that? Well, it's pretty plain to see that you're lost. You think so? Mm, the Somniel's a big place. Lots of twists and turns, it's easy to get confused. Uh, I do confess I am somewhat lost. If you're going where I think you're going, I know the way. Let me help you. Uh, thank you. This man has taken a hose. Stupid sexy Alfred. Let's see, Ivine Alchrist? This could be actually a pretty good one. Ivine Diamonds? Okay, I only got a couple more. <sighs> Did you need something from me, Prince Alchrist? <laughs> I see. You are pretending to ignore me. I still refuse to forgive you. You know why. How else should I behave in the presence of someone who helped to murder my father? <sighs> I apologize for my part in your father's death. You... you do? I know an apology can't heal your wounds, or... really achieve much at all, but we are now allies. I think it's important we find what common ground we can and meet each other halfway. Uh... That is why I'm taking this crucial first step. I am truly sorry about your father. Princess Ivy, I... I used to fear your family and your country. I never dreamed we'd end up on the same side. Life is so... unpredictable. It pushes us forward, ready or not. Holding on to past prejudices will only trip us up. From now on, I promise to do my best to find that common ground you mentioned. Thank you. But you should know that staring is rude. Uh, you're right. I apologize for being so careless. I won't let it happen again. At least we're looking in the same direction. Perhaps better times lie ahead. God damn. God damn. Ivy is... Oof. 